Hey everybody. So it is May 1st. Today is the first day of our push-up challenge. So the way this works is, you could see it on this graphic here, you do 500 knee push-ups or 1,000 push-ups, or maybe 1,000 knee push-ups, something like that. And that is the challenge. You get that done within the month of May. Any push-ups we program in the workouts, those count. And basically, anytime you do a real push-up where your chest touches the floor and your elbows are fully locked at the top, we count it. The rules to be entered into the drawing for the prizes are right there. You got to maintain a gym membership, get your full reps in, and you got to do 10 posts on either Instagram or Facebook or both of them in the month of May. Ta do the appropriate tags there. Tag us, tag King Kong Apparel, who's uh, donating the bags, and then hashtag CrossFit Bracken, CrossFit Breckenridge. And then we will do a drawing. There's two prizes for one of two of these bags. One's the backpack. These are gym bags. You can put your 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 gym shoes and all your stuff in there. It's made with all sorts of gym compartments. They're pretty cool. You can check them out on the website. Or the other one is the duffel. So that's our challenge, and uh, today will be the first day, so obviously we're going to be doing some push-ups. So let's look at our skill first. We've got every minute on the minute, so an EMOM. On the odd minutes, you're going to do 20 split jumps. On the even minutes, you're going to do 20 arch rocks. So it's for 10 minutes, so it'll be five for each. That's 100 reps for each movement. Let's take a look at those movements. We've got the split jump, so you're standing, and then you jump into a lunge. Tap that back knee to the floor. That's your standard all the way down. And then uh, keep that front knee so that it doesn't get way out in front of your toe. So a nice big wide jump. And then you jump to the other position, or you can jump back up to the middle and then jump to the other position. The rep is finished when that knee touches the floor, so that's your rep. And then our, uh, if you can't do that, we're going to uh, scale that to a reverse lunge. So some people have a lot of trouble jumping into that. Let's just do a reverse lunge, step backward, and then get that back knee to the floor, and then step back up to where you came from. And once again, nice wide stance on that and then the other movement doing on the even minutes is the arch rock so you're laying on your stomach bring your shoulders and feet up into the air get that crunch that superman position and then rock back and forth sometimes motivation for this rock is tough so get the feet up toward your head and then let everything rock back and forth and let's take a look at our workout we've got in the blue 10 knee push-ups and 15 air squats in the black it's 10 push-ups and 15 air squats so the same thing but the push-ups obviously will scale to the knees if you don't have um, push-ups off the knees 12 minute amrap which is as many rounds as possible so that's one round 10 and 15 you do that as many times as you can in that order so you got to finish your push-ups before you move to your squats let's look at the push-ups the knee push-up you're on your knees elbows fully extended drop your chest to the floor you do need to make contact with the floor that's our full range of motion don't fight gravity on the way down let it take you to the floor and then press back up keep your elbows close to your body press it till they're locked and that's your push-up if you are going off the knees or not on the knees you will have your legs legs straight and it's the same thing chest to the floor elbows extended if your legs are touching the floor even your thighs then you should probably be on your knees for this it will serve you better if you do that eventually you'll have much better push-ups and then the air squat so butt back and down hip crease below the top of the kneecap that's our standard get all the way down don't half rep us and then stand all the way up knees and hips fully extended chest up eyes forward get into a wide stand so your feet are about shoulder width toes pointed out a little bit that's your air squat so we're going to do 10 push-ups 15 air squats as many times as we can in 12 minutes that's our workout log your scores on beyond the whiteboard don't forget we have that push-up challenge so um, keep track of those as well so you know where you're at and start doing your uh, Instagram and Facebook posts if you want to win those bags. Those are pretty cool prizes. And uh, that's that. If you have any questions, let me know. I will see you tomorrow.